Hello, this is uh, Rebel Nebo here, and I'm just going to have a look at the Moog Mogafoga MF 108M Close to Flux. That's quite a mouthful. So, the Mogafogas were limited edition pedals that Moog recently had just uh, discontinued. Obviously, they need their components for bigger synths that are on the market at the moment, so um, pretty understandable. But these things are available on the second hand market and they're great units. So this is the, uh, the, the cluster flux, and this is what it can do. So I've just got a, um, a really sort of simple uh, lead patch here. So um, if I flick the bypass, you can hear the, um, the effect of the chorus. So it's a really nice like, thickening up of the, uh, the sound. Great, so um, here we've got the time control, and the time control that, um, that helps us specify the, uh, the time that the, the two signals for the chorus are sort of spit out and uh, the sort of gap between them. You can just hear that, it's quite, it's quite subtle. You can hear that sort of a sweeping sort of sound. Well, the thing that's like, really nice about this, co uh, this chorus pedal is that it's got this, uh, the feedback, so if I introduce the feedback, so the signal's like coming back in on itself and get in, and so that time um, delay is getting exacerbated with all the feedback. And we get, we get this really sort of um, weird sort of um, metallic feedback sound, very sort of pipe-like. And we can really hear that when we um, start to uh, mess around with the time. And that is pretty much like a phasing sound, it's pretty much what a phaser does. We're getting more of a phaser sound than a chorus now. But um, one thing that's like, really nice though is that we've got an, uh, an LFO, so we can actually modulate uh, the actual uh, time value to give us like a phasing effect. So if, um, I can just uh, introduce that by, I've got the LFO set onto a uh, sine wave waveform. So if I increase the amount, there we go, so um, we've, got, we've got that sort of sound, and I've just put the synth on latch so that I don't have to like, uh, keep the, uh, the key press down, so I can play around the controls, and we can play around with the rate and, and the depth, and uh, we, can, we can like uh, go subtle, but we can also go like sort of pretty off the, uh, off the scale as well. Flanger is a, it's a very similar effect. It's just it's got a different out emphasis, and if you sort of switch to the flanger mode, it's like much more high pitched. And it's got pretty much the same set of controls. There we go, get, getting that proper like 1980s out flanger sound. Close the plugs.